So do you guys like this wallpaper? Today I'm going to show you what's the fastest way to make a wallpaper like this in just a few other steps. Make sure you watch all the way to the end because this process is actually pretty pretty fast but I'm going to use a longer way to teach you guys so you, I will not speak too fast and you understand what I'm trying to say. So please subscribe to this channel and let's get started. So this is One UI 7 and this is S25 Ultra. Today I'm going to show it to you, okay? So now we're going to go to Google as you know, this is my Google. And we're going to say colorful wallpaper. Okay. And then you can see there are so many type of wallpaper right here. Let's just say I want to have something like this. Now, the newest AI, it's called AI Select, is from the side right here. A lot of people didn't understand last time. I'm gonna show it to you right now. There's a, this bar right here, you pull this out. And now you can see there is this option called AI Select. When you press AI Select, the AI will actually frame this for me. And right here, you can see set as wallpaper. When you press the three dot button, set as wallpaper. When you set this wallpaper, in a very few seconds, it will ask you what do you want right here. You want the lock screen, you want the home screen, or you want both. Let's just say I want both. Now I press next. And now you can see, you can even adjust your size of your clock. See if it's actually crashing the colors, okay? If you want darker, lighter, whatever you want, you can adjust anything you want. You can change your color, you can change your style, whatever you want. And then now we can go and set up lock star. So, but today I'm not going to do that. I'm going to go to done. When you press done, the new One UI 7, he will ask you, do you want to set up the palette according to your color of your, um, your wallpaper? So let's just say this wallpaper has so many colors. So basically they will give you so many options right here. And then at the top here, you can preview what does it look like. So let's just say I want to go like this you can see the color has changed. So let's just say I want something a little bit nicer. Let's say blue because it's blue here and there's a blue there. You can see how it looks like. Even the icon, because if you press this, apply, okay, on the icon, app icon. If you don't press this, you can see it doesn't change. If you press this, it will match the color as well too. So now let's just say this is my best color. I think this is the best color. And then when I press apply, and now you can see the whole phone has changed the color for me as well too. You can see that. And then you can see the app change. You can see the calling change. You can see the text message, the bar, everything changed as well too because according to the background color and you can see it actually looks really really nice at the background it's not like really full hd quality or 4k but it looks really really nice at the background right here so this is the best way to do the one ui 7 uh, background change so however, on the One UI 6.1, I'm gonna show you step by step if you want to use a similar way on the One UI 7. So this is actually a little bit different. We're gonna go in Google. Make sure it's the Google, not Chrome, not internet browser because it's much easier to crop the picture. So now you can see this is a picture. On the side, okay, same here, there's a sidebar right there. You got to look at it, okay? Now we're gonna press this. Now we have to tap. They do not auto select, not like One UI 7. And now you have to press download because when we press the three dot, there is nothing. So we have to press the three dot, uh, we have to press the download right there. Once we press the download, the image has saved inside. Now we have to hold any space at the home screen, okay? Not the app screen, but the home screen. And then we press anywhere we want, and then we press wallpaper and style and now we're going to change wallpaper now we're going to go to the gallery because we save the image press done and then you can see it's like this and now it's changed you can still change your clock whatever you want okay you can still do all these stuff but however if you notice you cannot change the palette so in order to change the palette you have to go 
right there color palette if you go back outside and now you have to go back to the original wallpaper to match the color at the front you can see that now we have to change the color palette according to this and that's it this is a one ui 6.1 but it doesn't match your original palette so let's just say if i do this when i press done and then see if i can change the palette just like that still doesn't do anything okay so that's why this is one ui 6.1.1 it works this way okay it doesn't work the way that that is but it just barely matched the color right here you can see that so i can do this and now you can see the difference how does it look right the icon doesn't change you can see the icon doesn't change the top right there it changed a little bit and then let's just say the phone it changed even the let's just say we go to the setting same thing okay so this is how it looks like but you can see the icon still look the same here but this icon is matching with the palette right here all right so please subscribe my channel and share this video and i hope this video helps you a lot thank you very much and have a nice day bye bye peace out